Yo, what's going on guys? It's Seabrev. Welcome to another MLB The Show 20 video. In this one, we're going to be doing a debut for the new Set 40 headliner, Future Stars Christian Pache, 98 overall from the Atlanta Braves. At a glance, this card is pretty unique. Uh, not as good as the other, you know, center fielders of this archetype in the game right now, such as Eric Davis, Byron Buxton. Uh, but definitely unique and something that I don't think people have noticed about this card or have taken into account is that he's one of the very few center fielders of this archetype like speed defense heavy uh, that actually maintains a diamond shield diamond defense in the corner outfield at a secondary position so the other guys like eric davis byron buxton they both go go to a gold shield in the corner outfield uh, prestige mantle goes to a gold shield in the corner outfield mvp trout is a gold shield in the corner outfield the only other card i can think of uh, that's kind of like this that has this in-game defense that is still diamond in the corner outfield would be prestige trout which not a lot of people have so this card got a lot of flack on twitter honestly for not being as good as the other center fielders in the game right now of this archetype but i think he's pretty unique you know because this card keeps his diamond defense in left and right field if you want like a defense heavy squad you can run this guy and eric davis or this guy and byron buxton and you just keep the other one in center field so I think uh, people may be sleeping on him a little bit. I liked his prospect card a lot. So let's do some ranked seasons gameplay for this video as well. We're going to be using an all Atlanta Braves squad, not an all time Braves squad, because uh, that would probably just be a 99 at every position. So this is just a squad of people that are actually Braves cards in the game right now. So uh, pretty much ideal, except I don't have 99 Eddie Matthews, but it's fine. So here's how the squad's looking. We are leading off the new Christian Pache. Excited to try him, see how his defense is. Uh, and we're going to be starting Kyle Wright just because Greg Maddox is not full energy because I was using him in ranks. So. Uh, also, don't have the closer smolts. Hoping to cheese someone and close with the 99 smolts. I think that'd be pretty cool. Let's hop into the game. On the road, taking on AJMS. He's got 99 John Smoltz on the mound, which is pretty hilarious. Pretty good team as well. Was hoping to face a lefty for Pache, but it is what it is. And we're at Forbes. <laughs> Why are we at Forbes, man? Well, I guess we'll see just how good his defense is out there in center. I really try to record a video and end up at Forbes Field. This is my life, dudes. Four pitch walk for Pache. Not exactly what I'm hoping for in the debut video, but we'll take it. We got the speed on base. Let's try to put one in the gap and score. Great backdoor slider there from Smoltz. We hit it perfect, perfect. We may get screwed by Forbes Field here. Yeah, we did. <laughs> that is so tough, man. Great swing by Hayward. Nothing we can do. Chipper down the right field line. Prestige Chipper, by the way. We already know Pache is getting his first run scored on this. 92 speed. No way he's going to be down. Awesome, awesome start, man. A walk and a run scored. Really showing off that speed. Mm. <laughs> That's a tough one, too, man. That swing was pretty good. It's okay. Only two down. One more shot to get Chipper home. Wow, Albies is hitting 515. I must have been using him in an events or something. Threw it right down the middle. We piece it into right for a line out. Tough first inning, man. We took great swings on the ball, but we got Pache his first run scored. Let's see how Kyle Wright does on the mound in this pitcher friendly park. Hopefully, Pache can get some opportunities in center field. Lazy fly ball to right field. Easy first out. Ellipsis. Through the left side. That's tough, man. <laughs> Vicky always gets on base against me. Mickey taking off. He swings and misses. Prestige Tory's got him by a mile. Great inning for Kyle Wright. He's mad that I was spamming up and in fastballs when he was hitting, dude. He's thrown two in a row. Will we get a third? Oh, he threw a changeup. And I rolled it over. That's why I shouldn't talk. Tory to the left side. Perfect, perfect for a single. Joe Torrey has hit so well for me. Tops now Marcel Azuna at the plate now. I don't really know how this card's going to play. I, I don't know if we've got an Ozuna with this high of attributes before. Slider down. Another single to left. Kyle Wright laying the bunt down foul. That's tough. We'll probably just have to strike out now. Give Pache a chance to hit with two men on, two out. Don't want to hit into a double play. All right, walking a run scored in the first. Now a chance to drive some runs in. What does Christian have for us? He's got a lazy fly ball to right field. <laughs> that one was my fault. Not the best pitch to swing at. Missed opportunity. 
We'll roll over to second base for Reggie Jackson. Kyle Wright cruising. Front door curve. That was disgusting. Ellipsis. Three strikeouts already for Kyle Wright. Hayward takes that low and away. Change up the other way against the shift. Hayward put some great swings on the ball twice already. We're going to push a three here. No, we got to go back. I think we're out, man. We really messed up. <laughs> we really messed up. So greedy there, especially with the leadoff hitter. That's terrible. Chipper up the middle for an easy ground out. Two down in the third. Matthews down the right field line. That one hurts especially because Hayward would have scored easily on this ball. See if we can get a little two-out magic from Ozzy Albies here. Wow, that was nasty. Gets through his legs. That'll let us go to third. Dude, that backstop is so far away. <laughs> I wonder if I had more speed if I could have rounded that. That's crazy how far that backstop is. Fastball up and in. And we're going to hit a Forbes line out to center. <laughs> God, this stadium is horrible. Oh, that's a very early dinky dunk single in the left. That one hurts. Hung the curve, but he rolls it over to second, and we turn to Albies the chipper. That's what we call justice. Smoltz with a hit up the middle. <laughs> That's what we call reverse justice. Biggio with the lazy fly out to right. Hayward's going to take this one. Pache could have got there easily as well. Three shutout innings. Freddie Mac taking the slider, getting way under it. Easy play in center. Fastball, 3-2, another perfect, perfect for Torrey. That's going to be a single. I could have maybe tried second there. It's a deep center field. We'll play it safe. Great pitch, man. Buried that splitter with two strikes. At least we get to turn the lineup over. Kyle Wright, lazy fly ball to left. Not expecting much from him. Still only one run for us. This guy has really sped his bat up after the first couple innings. We were blowing fastballs by him. Now he's gone to the other end of the spectrum. Ellipsis got him on the check swing. Mickey the other way. <laughs> Very late. Is Can Ozuna get him? No chance, man. Very late double. Can't get Mickey out, I told you guys. Got Reggie swing and two down. Carry with a bloop shot to right. We got a perfect indicator here. That took way too long for Hayward though. Feels so bad. Two very late swings for him. Gets him the tie game. Whew. He was sitting fastball and he crushed it with Griffey, but the field works in our favor here. Pache with the easy play. Tie game going into the fifth. Pache takes the splitter, rolls it over, but finds a hole because the third baseman was covering for the drag bunt. That's a benefit of the speed. Pache on base twice now. 3-2, change up in the dirt, walk for Hayward. All things considered, Hayward's had a great game. Two on for Prestige Chipper, nobody out. Man, Chipper is so good on this game. I don't think he hit that out because it's Forbes, but oh my god, that ball was crushed. We're going all the way to 30. Hit it off the top of the wall at Forbes Field. Unreal. 3-1 lead. That's exactly what we needed. Perfect, perfect. Man, Prestige Chipper is just such a monster. Matthew's got a slider right down the middle, and I just missed it. We should score easily on Mickey here. This is a very deep center field. I think he needs a perfect throw to even have a chance. We are in there. 4-1. to one. Change up or splitter down the middle. We're going to get Forbes again. <laughs> My PCI wasn't even really on that, so I can't be upset. Big Freddy Mac <laughs> with the absolute moonshot. Dude, Fred McGriff has the sickest no doubt animation. 5-1. to one. Huge inning. Joe Torrey up the middle. That's going to end the fifth, but we put a four spot up on him. That's big. Great pitch from Kyle there. Up and in right on the corner. Nice, easy pop out. Hung that slider a bit. Ozuna doesn't have the speed. Don Mattingly's on first, and I imagine John Smoltz today is done right here with him being down four in the fifth. Pinch hitting with Jason Giambi. <laughs> this is terrifying. Giambi's another one of those cards that I can never get out under any circumstances. Turns and burns on it. I told you I can't get Giambi out. He hesitated a bit with 40 speed. So with Hayward's arm, yeah, he's not going to be able to score. He messed up a lot on the bases there. We'll take that. Pulls it left, lines out to third. That is massive. 
Did not get the runner home. Now there's two down. I ended up leaving that sinker not where I wanted it. I got another perfect throw with Hayward on 24 speed here. I think we got him. Good throw by Hayward, man. We did end up giving up one, but great throw by Hayward to save another one. This is a dogfight right now. <laughs> dogfight at Forbes. Great pitch from him, man. I thought he was going to go sinker there. I'm looking silly. We're going to leave Kyle right in as well. Uh, Braves bullpen not the best on this team. <laughs> going to try to ride him as long as I can. Save 99 John Smoltz to close it out if I can. Struck me out 101 against the pitcher. That's just not fair. Pache with the lazy fly ball to center. I hit like horrible that whole inning. Hopefully we can keep pitching. That was atrocious. Mantle rolls it over to second. That's a big out. Reggie the other way, great swing, but we're there, two down. Sheffield swinging early at the slider. This is where things get scary, man. Kyle Wright's a little tired. I'm known to give up two out rallies. Ran the slider in on Griffey and got him to chase it. Onward to the seventh. He tried to go up and in sinker. Hayward's having himself a day, bro. Three hits, accidentally gunned down at third, but man. What a day for Hayward. He's stealing the show in the two-hole. Chipper to the right side. That's another perfect, perfect for him. That was a great spot for that changeup, too. Going to Billy Wags out of the bullpen, taking the lefty-lefty matchup versus Eddie Matthews. First pitch is right down the middle. Early swing, Eddie. No doubter off the foul pole. Blowing it open. 8-2. to two. How am I hitting so many home runs? Albies a dead center. That's dead off the bat, though. One down here in the seventh. Brad McGriff to center as well. I think that's staying in. Oh, my God. He actually hit that out left on left to dead center. We are popping off. Torrey to center field, too. Our timing is great this inning, man. Everything straight up the gut. Two down, though. Ozuna up the middle. Lines out. Going to try to stretch Kyle Wright one more inning here. Get as much mileage out of him as we can. Pop out first pitch of the seventh. Love to see it. Mattingly rolls it over to first. Danton pitch hitting off the bench. Another card I hate pitching to. <laughs> There's so many of them. Drop the slider in on him. Taking advantage of that tall strike zone. Beautiful pitching by Wright. Kyle Wright's day is done. We're going to go with Ronald Acuna Jr. off the bench. And we're going to throw the last two innings with 99 Smoltz. Closing it out as is meant to be. Change up. Got under it. One down. The nice part about him bringing in Franco, though, is we're going to get an A-B with Pache against a lefty here. Probably his last at-bat of the game. See if we can do some damage with the increased contact and power. Oh boy, did we do damage. Perfect, perfect, right up the gut. Pache's been on base three out of five times using that speed. This is exactly the debut we want to see. Now, if Hayward can keep this going with against a lefty as well, that's just going to be crazy. Trying to steal with Pache, got the worst jump of all time and had to take an emergency hack. But he throws it to second and throws it high and everyone's safe. What a disaster. By the way, Prestige Chipper is a home run away from the cycle right now. Screwball just below the zone. That's just great pitching, man. I wanted the cycle too bad. Inning, inning, double play. 99 Smoltz in to close it out. Closer for many years for the Braves. Buries the changeup and gets Biggio to swing. Up the middle for Sandberg. Hung that slider. I really want Pache to get a chance in center field. He hasn't really had an opportunity to make any plays out there. Mickey with the rollover to short. I think everyone's safe on this. Dude, Mickey and his very late swings are absolutely killing me. This is insane. Reggie, lazy fly ball to left. That's going to be two down in the eighth. Dang, Sheffield almost just took me deep. That was a good swing by him, but we're out of the trouble in the eighth. Still maintaining a seven-run lead. Up the middle for Eddie. That's his third hit of the game. Albies in the gap, breaking his 0 for 4. That's going to be an RBI triple, and we're going to have double-digit runs, man. The Atlanta Braves squad popping off. McGriff to dead center. He almost did it to him again, except he hit it to a deeper part of the park that time. Easy sack fly, 11-2. 
Torrey to left field. That's his third perfect perfect this game. I probably have double digit perfect perfects. I have just been absolutely crushing the ball. Ozuna rolls it over to second base. Honestly, I'm just trying to get to the ninth and get this game over with. Smoltz to the left side for a single. We get one more chance with Pache. Imagine Smoltz. Just allowed Pache to hit a dinger in his last at bat by getting a single there. Ah, we rolled it over to shortstop and blew it. Feels bad. Griffey chases the curveball. One down in the ninth. Blew it by him at 96. Smoltz gets him to chase it. Strikes out the side to end the game. Great all-around performance from these Atlanta Braves. Yeah, we ended up hitting 11 perfect perfects that game. <laughs> that's just insane. 12 runs on 18 hits. So that's going to do it for the debut for Christian Pache. Let me know what you guys thought down in the comments. Sorry it wasn't that exciting of a game for him, such as can be with debuts at times. Still got on base three times, scored all three times. Uh, didn't get to show off his defense very much, but pretty solid game all around. Uh, like I said in the intro, I think people are sleeping on this card for a corner outfield defensively. He's like basically the same as Taylor Trammell in left field, but actually has arm strength. He's basically the same as Jason Hayward in right field, but has more speed. I think he's one of the best defensive corner outfield options in the game right now. Here's how he did. Six plate appearances, went two for five with a walk, and uh, yeah, 900 OPS. Wish he would have done a little better, just a couple singles, but it is what it is. Hopefully you guys were entertained with the team build as well. Atlanta Braves popping off. I appreciate you guys watching. If you could like the video and drop a comment down below, it would help me out a ton for this. Uh, we'll see how these debuts go. I may start cranking them out more often, but I really wanted to try this card. I thought it was a lot of fun. So appreciate and love you guys. Thanks for all your support this year. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.